Here are 10 gaming myths that have been debunked by experts. Video games cause violence. Despite popular belief, numerous studies have failed to establish a causal link between playing violent video games and real-world acts of violence. Experts argue that factors such as mental health, upbringing, and socioeconomic status play a more significant role in determining violent behavior. Playing video games makes you antisocial. Contrary to the stereotype of the isolated gamer, research has shown that many gamers are socially active both online and offline. Online multiplayer games, in particular, provide opportunities for social interaction, teamwork, and communication among players. Video games rot your brain. While excessive screen time can have negative effects on physical and mental health, moderate video game play has been shown to have cognitive benefits, such as improved problem-solving skills, spatial awareness, and hand-eye coordination. Gamers are predominantly male. While gaming was historically male-dominated, recent studies have shown that the gender gap in gaming is narrowing, with nearly equal numbers of male and female gamers. Women and girls are increasingly participating in gaming across various platforms and genres. Only kids play video games. Gaming is not just for children. It's a diverse and inclusive form of entertainment enjoyed by people of all ages. The average age of gamers has been steadily increasing, with many adults incorporating gaming into their leisure activities. Video games are a waste of time. While excessive gaming can be problematic, Many experts argue that video games can have educational, social, and therapeutic benefits. Games can foster creativity, critical thinking, and problem-solving skills, as well as provide a sense of achievement and community for players. Video games are addictive like drugs. While some individuals may develop problematic gaming habits, gaming addiction is not recognized as a formal disorder by the American Psychiatric Association. Most gamers can enjoy video games in moderation without experiencing addiction-like symptoms. Playing video games makes you lazy. While sedentary behavior is a concern associated with excessive gaming, many video games promote physical activity and movement through motion-controlled gameplay, exergaming, and virtual reality experiences. Video games are a solitary activity. While gaming can be enjoyed alone, many video games offer multiplayer modes, online communities, and social features that facilitate interaction and collaboration among players. Gaming can be a social and communal activity for many people. All games are harmful for children. Not all video games are created equal, and many games are specifically designed for children with age-appropriate content and educational value. Parents can make informed decisions about the games their children play by considering ratings, content, and gameplay. By debunking these myths, experts aim to promote a more nuanced understanding of video games and their impact on individuals and society. While acknowledging potential risks, they also recognize the positive aspects of gaming and advocate for responsible gaming practices.